Question 9. We want to know how many solutions this system of equations has. How can we find that out? One of the best ways is to just rewrite both equations in y equals mx plus b format. And why does that help? Well, because then we can compare slopes and y-intercepts. Then we will know how many solutions the system of equations have. So, okay, so let me just rearrange the top equation first. Let's isolate y. So subtract 3x from both sides of the equation. 3x minus 3x is 0, so we get negative 5y equals negative 3x plus 8. Then we can divide both sides by negative 5. Those cancel out, so we get y equals negative 3 over negative 5 is just 3 over 5x. 8 divided by negative 5 is just negative 8 over 5. So we're adding a negative number, so this becomes a minus. Fantastic, okay. So the first equation is already in y equals mx plus b format. Now, what about the second? Oh, this one will be easier to isolate for y. So now we can just divide both sides by 5. So y equals, now I'll put the x actually in front of the 2 over 5. So we get negative 9 over 5x plus 2 over 5. Now, the slope of the first line is 3 over 5. The slope of the second line is negative 9 over 5. If the slopes are different, we immediately know one thing. We have exactly one solution for the system of equations. That's it.